Supreme Master Ching Hai is a world-renowned spiritual teacher, humanitarian, and artist. She has been invited to lecture on the Kuan Yin method of meditation throughout the world and to millions of people. We now invite you to view a short video entitled Walk the Way of Love, an introduction to Supreme Master Ching Hai. We will search high and low for a little love. For a little love to share with all beings in all corners of the world. <laughs> Supreme Master Ching Hai, as she has affectionately become known to those who've had the pleasure to meet or work with her, lives a message that walks the way of love. A renowned humanitarian, artist, and spiritual visionary, her love and assistance has extended beyond all cultural and racial boundaries to millions of people around the world, including the needy and the homeless, institutions of medical research on AIDS and cancer, war veterans of the United States of America, the disadvantaged elderly, the physically and mentally handicapped, refugees and victims of natural disasters such as earthquakes, floods, typhoons, and fires. Not only are human beings the blessed beneficiaries of her kindness, animals from different species are also the recipients of her boundless benevolence. Through these works, we witness countless reminders of compassion, which is the trademark of this caring lady and the international foundation that has grown out of her loving example. Whatever we can share, begin with sharing. And then we will feel a subtle change in ourselves. More love will be pouring into our consciousness and we will be aware of something. And that is the beginning. We are here to learn to learn to grow, as well as to learn to use our power, our limitless power of love and creativity in order to make a better world wherever we happen to be. Supreme Master Ching Hai was born in central Olak. During her early years, she was often found helping hospital patients, the needy, as well as injured animals in whichever way she could. As a young adult, she moved to Europe to study and continued there as a translator for the Red Cross. She soon discovered that pain and suffering exist in all cultures and in all corners of the globe. And her search for the remedy to this became the foremost goal in her life. She was happily married at the time to a German doctor, and although it was an extremely difficult decision for both of them, her husband agreed to a separation. She then embarked on what became a two-year journey in search for spiritual understanding. Finally, in the deepest reaches of the Himalayas in India, she found an enlightened master who imparted to her the Kuan Yin method, a meditation technique which contemplates on the inner light and sound. After a period of practice, she became fully enlightened. 
Soon after her return from the Himalayas at the earnest request of those around her, Master Ching Hai shared the Kuan Yin method with others, encouraging them to look within to find their own greatness. People from all walks of life found that through the Kuan Yin method of meditation, they attained greater fulfillment, happiness, and peace in their daily lives. Before long, invitations arrived from the United States, Europe, Asia, Australia, Africa, and South America, as well as important organizations for Master Ching Hai to give lectures. The peace and love that we um, most often talk about and seek, we have within ourselves. But the consequence the papare, it is not an ununderbrochen anstrengung. The future is in our hands. So you make it beautiful or you make it worse, it's up to you. As well as being a noble example of humanitarian aid, Master Ching Hai also encourages people to beautify the world we live in. Through meditating with the Kuan Yin method, Master Ching Hai has realized many spontaneous talents that she expresses through artistic paintings and creations, music and poetry, and aesthetic jewelry and clothing designs, expressing the inner and outer beauty of the cultures and peoples she has met. In 1995, upon the demand of the public, her clothing creations were toured on the international fashion circuit, including London, Paris, Milan, and New York. The income generated from her artistic creations has enabled Supreme Master Ching Hai to create an independent source of funding for humanitarian activities in support of her noble mission of assisting God's children in their times of need. Although she does not seek acknowledgement of any kind, in recognition of her selfless assistance, Supreme Master Ching Hai has been given awards worldwide by government officials and private organizations on numerous occasions. They include the World Peace Award, the World Spiritual Leadership Award, Award for Promotion of Human Rights, World Citizen Humanitarian Award, Award for Outstanding Public Service to Mankind, 2006 Goosey Peace Prize, Los Angeles Music Week Certificate of Commendation, and first place silver for the 27th Annual Telly Awards 2006. In addition, October 25th and February 22nd have been proclaimed as the Supreme Master Ching Hai Day in the United States. She is the light of a great person, an angel of mercy for all of us. Agradecer la Suprema Maestra su liderazgo, agradecerle su optimismo, agradecerle ese don de gente que tiene que la hace tan única y tan especial. Por una impresión muy grata de ver un corazón tan noble, tan dispuesto a servir. Ella está sirviendo a todos los seres humanos, está sirviendo al planeta para salvarlo, para rescatarlo. Tiene un corazón noble, pero también un gran liderazgo. Sé que van a suceder las cosas que tienen que suceder. Supreme Master Ching Hai is one of the truly dedicated people of this era helping others find and create a beautiful vision of our future. Many great people in history have had a dream, and in her own words, so does Supreme Master Ching Hai. I dream that all the world will become peaceful. I dream that all the killing will stop. I dream that all the children will walk in peace and harmony. I dream that all the nations shake hands with each other, protect each other, and help each other. 
I dream that our beautiful planet will not be destroyed. It takes billion, billion, trillions of years to produce this planet, and it's so beautiful, so wonderful. I dream that it will continue, but in peace, beauty, and love.